Hello everyone, welcome to another video of Dawn of Aurora. Yes, Dawn of Aurora is an amazing game. It's like open world, has heists, um, it's still being created so you get to watch it grow. Just think of Jailbreak, Mad City mixed with Fallout or Cyberpunk. Plus your guns to get damage. So it gives you a reason to constantly play to get money so you can back up. And I literally have no money. I just spent like 100000 But yeah, so there's a new update in Dawn of Aurora which added a lot of cool stuff. So we're definitely going to check that out. Or what I can check out. Let me kill this mutant first. Seriously, I had one more hit. I had one more hit on that mutant. Let's see if we can see him. Oh, he's right there. Look at this baby. And we got him. Also, I didn't mention on the last update video that when you kill mutants now, you have a percentage to drop items, loot, like clothes that you haven't bought yet. And now we're picking up rep. But yes, let me get back to a, the safe zone in Rust Town and we'll talk about what's added in this new update in Dawn of Aurora. Okay, here we are. So now we're gonna actually see what's in the update of Dawn of Aurora. Let me get like right back to ya and we'll see what's in the update. But before we start that, I didn't even say my intro. Hello everyone, I am Gore Punk. You're at the Goriest Punk YouTube channel. I love Loom Legacy, this game Dawn of Aurora, Bad Business, and I'm waiting for Anime Legends and Saiyan Rampage to come out because I do like some anime stuff. But LL is my top game. But yes, I am Gore Punk. Smash that sub button under the video if you're new. Go follow me at my Twitch and Twitter at Gorius Punk and give this a thumbs up. If not, you can give it a thumbs down either way. Thank you for the views, everyone. But let's get on and see what's in this new update. Okay, so right here it says Dawn of Aurora. Yes, we are in Alpha. Dawn of Aurora update. We got the new muscle car, which kind of looks like the junker car, but cooler looking. And it's located at all our vehicle vendors. And there is um what legendary, rare, and epic of those. We got a new pizza planet truck located at the Pizza Planet Prize vendor which I haven't really done nothing in Pizza Planet, so I won't be able to buy this truck. I'm 100% sure on that, because I have only been in Pizza Planet twice to like do some of the mini games to get tokens, kind of like Chuck E. Cheese's, how you get the tickets. In this game, there's their own pizza place where you can get your own tokens to buy stuff, and that truck actually looks cool because it's hovering. We got global storage has been increased from three to six pages, and I'm glad you did that, Sonic, because I'm full. I've been full. I literally got tons of guns backed up, even though some of you you guys have gave me legendary guns i just save everything i get which i should be selling it because i only got 2k money three new hackable breach points at the immigration center so i'm guessing that they must be new areas to breach to get in the town of aurora because there's an immigration section where if you haven't played this just like any immigration thing that you get you can't have no weapons on you you gotta have a um you know an id to let you allowed in the town of aurora but now it says there's three new hackable breaches so that means we can get our way in if we want to rob people do the heist citizens can now go in and out of aurora without getting whacked out nice they fixed that citizen spawn moved from the immigration center to Aurora Hub. Are a citizen now, you don't spawn in immigration and have to go through immigration, you're automatically in Aurora. Rep data now saves progress. Yes, rep data used to never save, so if you're like a, a criminal and killing the cops, the fear agents, you guys should know who fear is, they've been on Roblox for a long time, the fear community. So I'm guessing if you kill them, you used to get rep, saying that like, oh you're a bad person because you're killing cops, but every time you leave it would reset. So now it's always going to save it so we can know who to trust. Can now now exchange Pizza Planet tokens for Visa at the prize vendor. Pizza delivery job now uses the new Pizza Planet truck. Oh my gosh, so we can test out the Pizza Planet truck. Pizza peddler price lowered from 1 million tokens to 350,000. I'm guessing the Pizza peddler might be the moped to deliver pizzas. I did not know it was a million tokens. So now it's 350,000 tokens. I wonder if anyone ever bought the peddler bike for a million tokens because they just lucked out fix criminal spawning in the wasteland when dying in aurora fix zoning issue in criminal spawn blackjack now features hacking devices and c4 of each rarity type i can't think blackjack is but i'm guessing it has to be one of the heist boss improved toxic marsh lighting mutants now drop rep like we just seen a minute ago with each kill one 
through 5 depending on the level. Rep cap is 24. Arresting now rewards 5 reps. So now if you are a fear agent and you finally arrest someone to take them to prison, you get 5 reps. Killing criminal now rewards 1 rep. Becoming official citizen rewards 25 rep. Nice. Criminals can now do the pizza delivery job in Aurora. Beware. Can still be arrested during the job. That's insane. That means if you are a criminal being a bad person and you snuck your way in the town of Aurora and you decide, hey, I want to get a job delivering pizzas, just remember the cops of fear can still get you. But how about we get in this game and we'll check out some of the stuff, what I can check out, okay? So let's get on with this. Okay, so here I am and how about we actually check to see if there is six pages. And it does say one through six. If you can tell, look at my first three pages. They were full. And another thing, so how about we check out the new muscle car. Let's go see if it's showing up in the store so here's the junker i love the junker because i love mad max so the legendary of the new legendary muscle is 900,000. The epic version is 200,000. I was literally 100,000 away from buying them. The rare is 100,000, so all I could buy was the rare, which if the higher you go, you can tell, see the max speed and turn speed and max health of that. But I got like five cars or something. If you can tell, I still have not done the anniversary or the hover punk event. I'm very lack, I'm not a good DOA player. But here we go, we got the new muscle car. There we go, and let's get in. But yeah, look at this whole town. This is just the wasteland. If you can tell in the background where the skyscraper is above my head, I'm mainly talking about the town because there could be a lot of new subs on here because of my favorite game, LL, Loom Legacy. But yes, so here's the muscle car. Look at those tires. What we need is rims, but look at that muscle car. I love it. It's very shiny and very nice. I thought I just heard a mutant. Oh, the mutant's coming towards me, everyone. Let's get out of here. You wanna go down, mutant? Told you I got my pistol. You don't wanna mess with GP. The splatter punks unite, yo. I love the wasteland. Oh my gosh. Let's see what else it, that we can show off in the update. I could try to show the hackable breaches at the immigration, but I don't really know where those are yet. But we do got to go to the town of Aurora so we can check out the pizza peddler. I'm going to say, I hear a mutant, but I don't see it. And now he's shooting my car. My car almost sh broke down right there if he shot it two more times. But yeah, so let's make our way to Aurora. Let's drive through the marsh and see if we can see the new lighting. It is nighttime, so we probably can't really see the lighting. Lighting does look a little better, especially at night. Come on, mutants. I'm over here. Oh, we got the big mutant over here. This one explodes like a fart. Okay, here they come. I have not been in this water, and I did not know it was that poisonous, but wow, yep, yeah, the lighting in marsh is crazy. Dude, that uh, toxic water is amazing looking. Get our butt to Aurora so we can check out Pizza Planet. I do gotta turn in all my guns and everything because we gotta become a citizen. Ooh, I did not mean to do that. Almost broke my car down. We're gonna go to the immigrations of Aurora so we can get our butt in. It looks like everyone's being bad here. Okay, so let me go become a citizen real quick. Oh my gosh, I got a passport to Aurora. Yay! This reminds me of, like, Robocop. Oh my gosh! There we go. So now we're a citizen. Look at the town of Aurora. I haven't been in here to look for the extra balloons, and it looks like we got a most wanted. Now look at the muscle car up close in daylight. It's so nice looking. I like muscle style cars or any car that's like probably 80s or later. But yeah, we should be getting um, dungeons and probably apartments. So there's the uh, the new vehicle. How about we get in passenger for a minute while this guy does his pizza deliveries. But yeah, so this is the new um, Pizza Planet delivery truck, which you can ride it while you do your pizza delivery jobs. So I hopped in the car with this guy and it's, look at these hover wheels, man. I don't know if he's trying to deliver a pizza because we won't be able to see what he's seeing. But I'm thinking he's probably just testing out the vehicle. But yeah, I like how that truck looks. It's a nice looking truck. What's one versus one? A uh, pizza peddler, peddler price is lowered from 1 million tokens to 350 
thousand, which I probably only don't even got a hundred. Pretty much that's all that's new. Pretty much what I read off. The immigration stuff, like where we just went through with our passport. It probably would take me a while to figure out the, the extra spots. We're at like Chuck E. Cheese, pretty much Pizza Planet. But before we check out, how about we play a mini game? Because I usually get, um, we get free thing for a mini game. I think it's right here. Yep, we get one free spin the wheel once a day and earn free pizza tokens. Yes, let's play. Oh my gosh, I just got a thousand. Are you serious? But yes, now let's go up and check this guy out. So yeah, right here, here it is. Uh, Visa is a currency that can be used to purchase weapons, vehicles, and more. So it looks like you can literally pick out. So right now, so it looks like a thousand tokens will only give you 250. 2,000 tokens will give you 500 Visa. So the legendary is 500,000 for the legendary Pizza Planet truck. And it seats four, pretty cool looking. I forgot we can move it around right there. But while we're here, how about we just do a little drive by of Aurora. See if we see anything change. It looks like these buildings to my left got to upgrade, but I didn't really go through here in the last update, which was a lot of bug fixes to make the game run better. But yeah, this is one amazing game, one beautiful game to be on Roblox. Like, look at this. I can't believe there's not a lot more people playing this, but yeah, we only got two heists right now. But yeah, I pretty much showed you what um told you and showed you what I can show you in the in this new update which is a pretty nice update we got nice little stuff I mean yes everyone would want more heists more ways to make money because if you can tell I only got three thousand dollars right now three thousand visa oh that was the exit that's right near rust town like look at that we just boom we just got right out yeah that was pretty much what was added what i talked about what i showed you what i could show you but yeah this is the new update for dawn of aurora which added the new on um, pizza planet truck added this new awesome looking muscle car which i could kind of buy the good one let's see we got some people fighting over there this is new update dawn of aurora i'm gore punk you're at the goriest punk youtube channel if you are new smash that sub button right under the video go follow me at my twitch and twitter at goriest punk and thumbs up or thumbs down. Either way, thank you for stopping by and checking out this awesome update video of Dawn of Aurora. I'll see you guys on the next video or stream. Peace out and have a wonderful day.